So the Denver MBA really has flipped the traditional uh, classroom or curriculum model and the center of gravity for the new Denver MBA is four core challenges, not core courses. We still have the classic content that you get in any MBA program, but the core of the program are these four challenges where you're working on real world business projects with business actors uh, and getting real time feedback on whether or not you have the skills you need to be successful in the marketplace challenges. The first challenge is the enterprise challenge. This is in the entrepreneurship space. It's really leveraging the entrepreneurship community that's really deeply part of the ethos of Denver and of Colorado. And what you're doing in the first enterprise challenge is you're repeatedly pitching a business idea. You'll pitch repeatedly over and over again to your classmates. You'll have an a active entrepreneur who's a mentor that you'll be getting input from and pitching to. And then you'll be pitching to people in the business world, uh, culminating in an event at an incubator in town where you'll be pitching with the possibility of getting some funding to start your business. So you start in the entrepreneurship phase with the enterprise challenge. And what you learn there is partially what you don't know. You're coming back to school to get your graduate degree and you find out, I want to start a business. I need basic accounting, finance, marketing, management, ethics, law. I need these basic skills to be successful as a business person. And so then the second challenge over your winter quarter is an opportunity to uh, take a deeper dive and begin to apply those skills that you're learning through the program in a different context. It's in the social good challenge. And so what you're looking at then is how can you apply your business knowledge in a nonprofit or governmental setting? Every year, the Social Good Challenge has a different theme. The theme for this year is the city of Denver. So we're working on lining up some projects with the actual city of Denver, working on some nonprofits that are really Denver-focused and uh, face some real important problems that a team of MBA students can really help them fix. And it may be around data, maybe around marketing, maybe around operations, but you get a chance to apply in a social good setting uh, those skills. And you also get a chance to see what it's like to operate in constrained resources. This is not a Fortune 25 company or 100 company. This is a small nonprofit looking at homelessness in Denver. So it's a different context. Spring quarter is the corporate challenge. This is the most similar to kind of a traditional capstone project in a lot of MBA curriculum. Uh, you'll be working with uh, companies either headquartered in Denver or have a regional presence that's large in Denver. And it's your opportunity to, at this point, you're in your third quarter of work. So you've learned all of that foundational MBA content and knowledge. And you're applying it in a consulting role on a real project that Noodles & Company or Southwest or a large corporate partner is facing. Spend the summer in your internship, applying, passing the market test again and again. And then in the fall, you come back to the capstone experience. And the capstone experience is a global challenge. And so you spend the fall on a project. It might be with a, a nonprofit doing something focused in the social good space. It might be focused on entrepreneurship. Uh, or it might be more of a kind of traditional corporate project. But you spend the fall preparing. And then December, you're on the ground. Having run multiple of these projects, uh, similar looking sort of courses in the past, what happens is you do all that pre-work, all that planning, you get on the ground, and everything you thought you knew, you find out is wrong. And so all of your work is blown up. You have this real opportunity to learn about how to be an effective business leader, how to solve business problems in a context of real ambiguity, mm -hmm. of stress, and you come back and you wrap up that project, uh, again, providing real value to a company and showing that what you're doing really passes the market test. That you were able to go roll out a marketing plan that's used by a large company in Indonesia. Or you were able to figure out how to deal with some operational concerns that a large nonprofit has as you're trying to improve educational infrastructure in Africa. Uh, so you get a chance to really test it on the ground. Uh, and it's culminating. It builds on everything that you've learned before.